Today we are looking at a door control called a BSUM Unislide. And this is what it looks like. These tabs on the back, you can gently pry them up. There's going to be one screw here. You remove it. I believe it will be a Phillips screw. And you pull this up. The screw was gone before I was actually able to get to that point. Then, you're going to need a torque screwdriver, a T10. And yeah, T10 by 3, which I think this just means it's 3 inches long for this the, the bit part here. I'm going to take it apart. Now I'm going to show you. I could take and power this up. There should be one red LED right here and if that LED is not on I'll show you what you need to take and replace on this board there's a couple of screws I just did one right here by the fuse tower and there will be one by the power and there'll be one back here by the uh, encoder and motor. And then you have these two standoffs, which I'm going to have to find a uh, pair of pliers so I can take this off real quick. I have these standoffs loosened up. I can take them off. And then you'll be able to see the circuit board underneath. So this is what it looks like on the top. You'll notice it will have this is glued down vibrations and that coil that coil will actually fall off due to the vibration and this is the bottom of the circuit board I just felt something loose here but it's just typical of that wiggling so this part here, this guy right here, typically it's going to be the problem child. Part number is ML4824IS1. And I'm going to have to look and see if that's what the issue is. I will plug it in the power and make sure that it has voltage. If it doesn't have any power to the LED, then I'm fairly certain that that's what the issue is. Also wanted to make sure that it's not the fuse tower. It is not also the fuse being bad. It's been a couple of years since I've opened one of these up, so I kind of want to see circuitry. It's amazing all the little uh, components that's on near surface mount resistors and capacitors. They didn't label a lot of these resistors and capacitors. Actually, they didn't label any of them. So, I find that kind of amazing that B-SUM was able to do that. So, let me plug it in 
If it doesn't have any power, I'm going to have to get this chip ordered. And once it gets ordered and came in, I'll show you how to change it out. And then, once it's working, so when you plug it in, the power is on. And then from there on out, you shouldn't have any issues. Okay, I have the power cord. I'm going to plug it in. And we will see if this little red LED comes on. And hopefully, that will be the case. That it won't come on. And it's not on. So, it tells me that that chip is bad, or that we have a bone fuse. So that's going to be the next step. Using your voltmeter, put it to 200 ohms, or your continuity, and let's check and see if we have continuity. And we do, it's good. Zero ohm means it's a solid fuse. All right, so I'm gonna order that chip and change it out, show you how to change it out. And then once it's changed out, you'll be able to see that that red LED comes on. So if you notice the orientation of this chip here, the circle means pin one. So you wanna put that chip back in where pin one is. Since I glued the chip down, I'm going to have to take and heat it up with an air solder. Now there's two socket sizes that you can go with. And the fat one is a wider pan. This one, possibly, they're both obviously, but you might be able to find the other chip. In different quantities. So now I'm going back over each pin and adding a little bit of solder. That way I know they will have good continuity. I'm gonna make sure that this product is gonna stay working. A lot of vibration in the doors.
Well, let's see if they fix their problem. Which I'm pretty certain that it will. I'm going to power it up now. It should have a little red light. And I do. Well, that's all it was for this controller. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. If you need this repaired, email is in the end of this video. Send me an email, and we'll talk about getting your six.